And live from Austin, Texas, the show band of the Southwest, the extremely legendary Kinky Friedman and the Texas Jubal. <laughs> Just a ship out on the ocean, a speck against the sky. Amelia Earhart flying that sad day. With her partner, Captain Noonan, on the 2nd of July. Her plane fell in the ocean far away. There's a beautiful, beautiful field far away in a land. That is fair. Happy landings to you, Amelia Earhart. Farewell, first lady of the air. Long about 8:30, her SOS was heard. Her signals weak, but still her voice was brave. In shark-infested waters, where a plane went down at night. In a blue Pacific to a watch of green. There's a beautiful, beautiful place far away in a land that is fair. Happy <laughs> landings to you, Amelia Earhart. Farewell, first lady of the hour. Wichita! This awful tragedy. <laughs> Years to come, though others blaze and trails across the sea, we'll never forget Amelia and a plane. There's a beautiful, beautiful face far away in a land that is fair. All right, we might bring up a little monitorial area just a tad now. About ready to uh, do this particular song about a one evening. There the bee right there now. Must have gotten uh, in the case of the heebie jeebies over there. <laughs> I like to say that uh, it's quite understandable. So, a little vomit omelet on their head a few moments ago here. But that's what I'm now, as a rule, I never pick up a hitchhiker. That's a motto of mine. I never do it. But on this particular occasion, this old boy was sitting there in the full lotus. I see some folks from Kerrville, Texas here this evening. All right. Thank you very much. You're All right, there they are. Gordon and Peggy over there now. Nice. Wonderful Americans come down to the show here in Austin now, but glad to have you folks here this evening. Um, as a rule, I never do pick up a hitchhiker. On this occasion, this old boy was sitting there in the full lotus position by the side of the road, and I had to pick him up. He told me a very unusual and somewhat tedious story about uh, his problems, and I wrote a little song about the bugger. <laughs> <laughs> 